Hello everyone, I'm Fria from the Mac Arena community team. 2023 has been full of massive changes in the game. And now we are ready to fully reveal the icing on the cake of Mac Arena improvements this year, the visual redesign. With this update, Mac Arena will look less like somewhat peaceful sport of the utopian future and take on a more badass aesthetic. Our narrative theming will match, building out the Macarena world with stories of awesome characters and ruthless corporations, resolving their rivalries through Mac-based battles. But that shouldn't be breaking news for you, should it? It all started with the appearance of Killshot's Doom Scream skin in Battle Pass Season 9. Your extremely warm feedback made us realize that you guys were looking for something a little different. So we started to investigate. After several months of research, it was clear that you wanted to see more badass visuals, major themes, and epic environments that went beyond the sports stadium. So we went for it. While working on realizing this new approach, we started releasing content that fit the new style, which I'm sure you already have noticed in the game. Max, such as Onyx and Scorpius, pilots such as Asmodeus and Neve, dark, off-world maps such as Artifact X and VMD Lab, released during the Solid Survival Global event. The more content of this style we added to Mac Arena, the more positive the feedback was. And now, after 9 months of preparation and development, we are ready to release our revamp of Mac Arena visual style. First, Max, of course. All Macs released before and including Redeemer will change their default looks to tougher and cooler ones, as they'll receive new basic models. The models will include more polygons and higher quality textures. I mean, just look at this tango, it doesn't even need to activate Sky Strike to make it up and it's shake with fear. I leave this one as a teaser. For more insider info, check out our official content creators challenge. There, they'll unveil more new looks of some of their favorite Macs. And soon enough, you'll be using Macs with the new designs yourself. Oh, and if you have a soft spot for the old base models, don't worry, they'll still be there as skins. Also, coming with the redesign are visual updates to the tutorial map and the Mac Arena Control Point Clash map. They'll immerse you in the game's new wipe right away. Try not to stare at the details for too long during a match, though it could cost you a victory. Since we're updating the lion's share of the content in the game, we had to take a fresh look at how it's presented. So we've revised pretty much everything. The launch icon, the preloader screen, and the main hangar, as the most attentive of you spotted in our most recent devlog. The content overview has been totally reworked too, putting the Mac, weapon or pilot in the spotlight where it belongs. And those animations, so satisfying. There is also a YouTube button under the Mac or weapons model when you observe it. Tapping on this button will lead you to a useful video on our YouTube channel. By the way, make sure to subscribe, hit the like button under this video, and turn on notifications to get informed about the newest videos there. With redesign, the pool of videos on our channel will definitely increase, so stay tuned! All players will be able to experience the Macarena visual redesign with the next release. We are currently polishing the final aspects, so you can enjoy the new look within a couple of weeks. We'll keep up the pace of delivering new Macs, weapons, and pilots. We're also improving how the Max Arena AI behaves in matches and how our matchmaking works. And get ready to welcome Hangar Presets, a handy feature that you've been asking for. This wraps up today's news. We can't wait to present this to you, and we hope you're as excited as we are to get your hands on the new and improved game. Thank you for being with us. There's a lot more ahead, so stay tuned and see you in the arena.